Love is Blind creator reveals Natalie was proposed to in the pods by someone else before getting engaged to Shane. Hey guys, and welcome back to another shared news. We've got more Love is Blind tea for you guys today, if there hasn't been enough already. But before we get into it, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell so you never miss out on any future videos. As always, I am your host and Love is Blind super fan, Zachary Reality. And if there was wasn't just two full-blown couples engagements that got cut out of Love is Blind, there was also another proposal cut out as well, or should we say an attempt at a proposal. The creators of the series, Chris Collins, shared there was another guy who very, very early on was really interested in Natalie and basically proposed to her. It was very out of the blue. He just felt like he knew, and she was like, this is weird. She didn't have any deep feelings for him, but he had developed very significant feelings for her. Anyway, she said no and he left and that was that. So this mystery contestant was not revealed. Obviously, there was so many people cut from Love is Blind this season, so we don't know which guy it is. If you guys want to do some digging, let us know who you think it might be in the comments below, but I personally have no idea which contestant this would be. Now, one thing about Love is Blind is that you're truly dating blind and the only way to meet the person you're dating is to get engaged to them and propose. So I kind of understand why some contestants wanted to propose if even if they didn't really mean it or even if they weren't ready just so they can get out of the pods and escape to Mexico and meet the people they're dating or the girl they're dating or their fiance. But just in general, I think it's kind of a way to escape from the pods and hopefully further your time on the show. So it is possible that this contestant was thinking that and that some other contestants from the show were kind of on the same wavelength. I mean, think about being stuck in the pods and there's only one way out and that's to get engaged. Now, the creator of the show continues saying it wasn't relevant to Natalie and Shane's story, and there's only so much footage that could be shown. So this is this is why the reason why they did not end up showing it on Netflix. And Love is Blind was only nine episodes, with Friday's reunion being the 10th. And considering Love is Blind is a streaming surface on Netflix, I feel like it would probably be easier to give us more episodes versus a show on cable where you have to kind of pay for the programming and kind of set all that up. So I don't understand why they gave us such a short season of nine to 10 episodes when a lot of other reality TV seasons are 10, 12, 14, sometimes 18. So a couple extra episodes to give us more context on the Love is Blind relationships and backstories would not have hurt. Now, as far as Natalie, we know she ended up turning down Shane at the wedding, and there's been so much speculation that the couple has rekindled their relationship since the show wrapped. Shane even posted on Instagram the other day saying that Natalie made him a better man, which she replied to with a heart and even reposted the post on her Instagram story. There is also a reunion clip on Netflix's YouTube channel with Natalie apologizing to Shane for not making him feel like he is good enough for her, which is so mind boggling because I feel like a lot of us feel like Natalie deserves way better than Shane. So it seems like the two of them are going to have to kind of talk things out and they might have possibly rekindled their romance. So we will definitely have to stay tuned because Natalie was a shining star this season and her relationship with Shane was a huge spectacle. A lot of people have opinions on it. Would you guys like to see more Love is Blind episodes in the future, longer seasons? Maybe they're going to give us a few extra episodes down the line and what do you guys think the future holds for Natalie and Shane that is everything we have to share with you guys today so let us know in the comments and be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell before you guys go so you never miss out on any future updates as always I'm your host Zachary Reality you guys can follow me down below at Zachary Reality come say hi check out my content over there thank you guys so much for watching and we'll catch you in the next one bye